This is Tyler Rogers, and you're watching Bay Area Sports Wrap. Just where are you at right now with, with today's game? Well, still not where I really want to be. Um, you know, I, the first thing to change up was god awful. Uh, and then sort of throwing it more and started to figure it out a little bit better. And uh, still some things I got to clean up, but you know, as long as the team wins, I'm all good. What did you feel changed with the change up as the game went on? I honestly couldn't tell you. I'm gonna, it just felt better. Um, it's it's very fr baseball is a frustrating game sometimes, and uh, I think just throwing it more, I got a better feel for it. The team obviously kind of struggled to support you last year. I mean, what was it like to just see them come back today? Um, yeah, I mean, it was awesome. Anytime we can come back in a game and win a game, it's, it's great. It's, as long as we win, uh, I'm all good. Was your range of emotions in the air and the trainers are watching that the uh, would be double play turn into game time? Uh, it was it was like damn at first because we got it first and then the ball came out and we were all screaming in there and it was exciting. So uh, when Chappie came up and had a big hit, it was uh, uh, love to see it. Talk about just the impact Chapman's had already on this team so far, ten games and both with his batting and with his glove. Honestly, I think the, the most underrated part of Chappie is his, uh, you know, his leadership and, and what he brings you know, inside the clubhouse, inside the dugout, the energy he brings every single day. Um, you know, times when we might get down early and he's, you know, he's coming in the dugout, he's saying, let's go guys, you know, kind of firing the guys up. And, uh, I think that's something we might have lacked a little bit last, um, you know, last couple of years, and, and he brings that. So uh, you feel it as a, as a teammate. Uh, obviously, you guys see him play out there on the field. Um, you know, he's the best defensive third baseman in baseball, and uh, he's a great hitter. Um, you know, I, it's 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 fun to watch every single day for sure. Um, but like I said, I think the most underrated part is the the leadership and, and teammate wise how he how he is. No walks today. It seemed like you really had a good command. You had a switch there from the third to the sixth inning where you threw 22 pitches and 21 were strikes. Yeah. Your change you yeah, just uh, I, I started to feel comfortable with it. Uh, I threw a couple good ones in that second inning. Um, you know, and as long as I'm comfortable with it, I'm, I'm going to throw it as much as I can. Uh, and I think that was, that was important to get going. Uh, I think that's something that uh, I kind of I think I kind of lacked the last outing. I think I threw a lot of pitches early, and then I, I, I got into try to strike everybody out mode. And I'm not that guy. You know, I, as much as I wish I was, uh, uh, you know, I, I think getting getting into the dugout and, and getting the bats going as fast as I can out there is is the most important. Thing. You were getting the ground balls. When yeah. You needed. Yep. Uh, yeah. It's. Uh, if I, if I can get him out in the first two, three pitches, that's, that's what I'm trying to do every single time. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Drew Amanda here for Bay Area Sports Wrap. Please give us a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.